Let's talk about one of the game plans that we have talked about for uh, many years, which is the concept of refi till you die. Okay, you've heard of the rule of 72s, right? And that just means that things double, okay? And we'll see how they double at different rates. So in this example, let's talk about a property portfolio where you've purchased 10 properties in diverse markets and say the properties were $100,000 each. So you've got 10 $100,000 properties. To buy them, 20% down is $200,000. And then you've got closing costs, that's about 35,000. And then you've got reserves, remember I did say 4%, 4% of a million is $40,000. So $275,000 total, and here's how it works. You started with this $1 million portfolio, 10 properties, diverse markets, and so the way it looks is like this. You've got your $235,000 initial investment. You've got loans for $800,000 or 80% of the value. And your equity is $200,000. When 12 years go by at that 6% appreciation rate, your portfolio is going to double by the rule of 72. So now you've gone from 1 million to 2 million in 12 years. Say you're 40, 40 is the new 25. So now your property is doubled, you're 52 and you've got a million dollar gain already. And you stopped, you just did the 10 and you quit. And then you just let it ride. You go to the bank and you say, hey, I've got equity in here, so I wanna pull my equity out, I wanna engage in something I call equity stripping. You have the properties, you own the assets, but you strip the equity out of them. You still own the asset, but you got all the money out. So then the bank says, okay, your $2 million portfolio, 80% of that, we will loan you that. So we're gonna give you loans totaling $1.6 million. And now your equity has doubled to $400,000, difference between 2 million and 1.6 million in financing. So $400,000 in equity. And you've got $800,000 in cash that you can now stuff under your mattress. You can go to Las Vegas and gamble it away. You can you know, do whatever. For the next 12 years, if you just take this $800,000 and divide it by 12, and you don't invest it, you stick it under your mattress, it earns zero return, you have $67,000 a year tax-free. Why? Because there's no tax on borrowed money. This 67,000 tax-free is equivalent to, well, it depends on your tax bracket, 100,000 is fair. That's about $100,000 taxable equivalent. So let's go to the next cycle. Let's go another 12 years. Now remember, you're only 52 and you're now living on this tax-free money every year. Another 12 years, now you're 64 years young and 64 is the new 40. Now your property portfolio has doubled again. It's worth $4 million and you've got a $3 million gain from your original $1 million investment, and you go to the bank and say, hey, refinance me 80% loan to value. Okay, we'll give you $3.2 million in loans. Your equity has now doubled again to $800,000, and you've got $1.6 million in cash. Now you've got 1.6 million, and for the next 12 years, just divide it. Don't invest it, don't earn anything on it, stick it under your mattress. You have $133,000 a year to spend tax-free. That's probably equivalent to about, you know, nearly 200,000 a year in taxable. So you're 64, now let's go 12 more years, and now how old are we? We're 76 years young, 76 is the new 55, and now our portfolio is worth $7 million. We refi, we get 6.4 million in loans. We have 1.6 million in equity, our equity has quadrupled. So now we've got $1.6 million in equity, we've got an asset worth $8 million, a $7 million gain, and we've got $3.2 million cash out tax-free. Divide by 12, we got a quarter million dollars a year tax-free to live off until we're 88. And 88 will be the new 68. This is a projection. You should always check with your tax advisor about tax benefits. And if you'd like to learn more, listen to my podcast and visit my website at jasonhartman.com.